you know, both horses tick, tick the right boxes and you know, hopefully we can have a bit of luck on the day. And the young master, not got much more weight than when he won the, uh, the bet 365 at the end of last season. Yeah, and you know, he jumps, he stays, and um, you know, Sam's got a great record around the Grand National fences. So, um, you know, we're very happy and fingers crossed we can get them there in one piece. And Carol's Destre, second to Native River in the Hennessy, that form looks better and better. Yeah, the form is very good, obviously, on the day, you know, you, you hate finishing second, but to finish second to a horse that is obviously had an unbelievable season, you know, we're, we're delighted, but, you know, fingers crossed we can finish off on a good note too somewhere. And you've come close to winning a national with the, the Druid's nephew going so well when he came down. How would these two compare? I think these two horses would be um, more, they tick a few more boxes than what the Druid's nephew would. You know, like the Drewish nephew's been a great horse to us, with Shetland Festival winner, and um, you know he hasn't, he doesn't have an entry this year because he'll be aimed at the Bet365. The young master will go to the ultimate chase where he finished third in the last season. Um, he, he's a horse probably that you wouldn't want to have too fresh um, going into the national. He, you know, he, as he proved in last year's Tennessee, you know he can just be a bit fresh in the early stages. So it, it would suit him to go to the Shetland Festival and Carl's Destrier will go somewhere between now and then.